Oh. My. God, do you remember that moment when video games, or should I say your favorite, favorite characters came to life? That is what this game did. Hey guys, what is up? This is Supergirl Kels. Welcome to Road to Smash 4 Part 3, where we're doing Super Smash Brothers Melee, the walkthrough of Adventure Mode. This is where it was introduced, so that's why we're doing it. This is Super Smash Bros. Melee, the best in the series, which is uh, by fan favorite, what people are calling it. And I'm going to take you on this journey using my favorite characters in each game. So last time I used Kirby because I used him in Smash 64 and now we're gonna go on to actually using Sheik. Sheik over here is what I used to use in Millie and we're gonna actually challenge ourselves. Of course I'm always gonna play in normal mode and we're gonna go ahead and use Sheik. I always used green. Don't ask why. I don't know why either. It just it just kind of happened. I used green. And now we're at the Mushroom Kingdom. I'm not trying to get Giga Bowser or anything like that, but I will be, you know, just kind of going through this. Oh, man, I guess it didn't work. Okay. Well, wow, I forgot how fast you can transform in Millie. I completely forgot. I oh, Jesus. <laughs> My God, compared to Brawl, she takes like two five seconds to transform and here it's just like oh i'm just gonna hop along right now but i love chic like when i first started millie it was the game i grew up with after smash 64 smash 64 came out when i when i was five or four like i said and then like i only found out about it when like it was at the end of its time and then when the GameCube came out, I wanted it right away, and I remember I was just playing the N64 version in my room with my cousin, and then my mom came- Jesus, man, they're hard to kill. Come on. I'm trying to remember this, guys, because it's been a while, and I'm a- Oh, God, it's just gonna get worse! Ugh! Bye. Stupid. I'm gonna kick your butt. But I remember how, like, excited I was. My mom came downstairs. Oh, the C-stick doesn't work. That's why I didn't do anything. I use the C stick in Brawl, so. Oh wow, that thing's a spike. Damn! Excuse me, I'm just gonna freaking hit you in the face. Bye. But I, she came down, I got Millie, and I remember the first time I saw that intro, which still blows me away nearly 15 years after its release. My. My. God, I'm pretty sure it's five. Okay. I'm gonna just do that. I wanna see if it actually is five. I don't remember. But I don't know, man. We'll find out if it was time or not. <laughs> I was so excited. I saw Mario come to life. Kirby, like, this kind of, it was just, oh. And then I saw just Pikachu. I was blown away by these graphics. This is next gen graphics. When, like, Xbox One and, like, Nintendo Wii U talk about next gen, it is not next gen. This was next gen back then. This was, like, completely new. It wasn't just about polygons and shapes anymore. This is, this is Millie. This is what changed graphics. Like, this is just realistic stuff right now. Okay, that guy's coming in. Can I just pop him? Come on. Go over there. Go over there. Go over there. Okay, there you go. Thanks. Have a good day. <laughs> I wanted the Luigi to come out, but yeah, I don't, I totally didn't remember. I guess it wasn't 25. I don't remember much of this game. I mean, everybody knows I am competitive, uh, competitive when it comes to Brawl. I've played in this community for like six years and then that's it, I was done. But Millie, man, when that game came out, I played until the release of Brawl. I played for those five, six, seven years straight, like just going to my cousins playing this just all the time. I wasn't like competitive or anything. But if this was the game that just I could like, I could play this all the time. And when I when it came to multiplayer, it wasn't about Mario Kart for me or anything. It was Smash Brothers. This is my game. This is my life right now. This is my life. Oh my god. But I totally like remember the characters. I mean, first I started off playing as Kirby, of course. You know, and I and I still play Kirby. Kirby's not the best in this game. Everybody knows that. I think he's the lowest of this tier. And then oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh thank Jesus. Woo! Damn, I'm just gonna be coming right over here. Damn, his, I don't know if my controller is broken, but I feel like I'm supposed, I can use the C-Stick, but I just, excuse me, I'm just gonna bring this Oh, wow. <laughs> Jeez, damn. Uh, I don't even remember what I was saying. The point is, is just, 
Kirby. Yeah, Kirby was what I used, of course, because he's Kirby, right? And then Pikachu. Those were, like, the main I would always play. But then, like, as I was growing up, I really started loving Sheik and Fox. Of course, because it stopped. I was, good, I was gonna use Fox, but just because it's so... That's the character that's kind of top tier in this game, I feel like it would have been boring. So I said, hey, let me use Sheik. Why not? So here was Sheik. And also, I used a lot of uh, Young Link at times, just randomly out of the blue. I like the feeling of Young Link. And uh, the first time I ever completed Millie, I remember when Game & Watch was announced. And for some reason, I loved his look. I just never knew that character before. And then when I saw <laughs> Game & Watch, I used it for like two months straight, nonstop. Like I would play the game just for Game & Watch. I loved Game & Watch's design and look. And then I just I was like, oh, forget. But this is the game that just, oh, I fell in love with Nintendo because of Smash Brothers. It wasn't because of any other game, like Mario or anything. Like, everybody knows I was a Sonic girl, I was a Sega person. And then when Smash Brothers came around, that's when it all changed. I played for, um, pretty much Nintendo only. I never really changed after that. It was always Nintendo. So, are you kidding me? You know, you're too slow, though. Come over here, Link. Link? I, come on, don't you know I'm Zelda? <laughs> Serious? I'm pretty sure that was a poison mushroom. That was not cool. He should have been. Oh, wow. Oh, I was trying to make him fall, but fine. Oh, jeez. Don't you dare pick that up. I. Bye. All right, now we're metal. So right now, this is a maze that we gotta go through. This is something that they implanted that I found so cool. This was. Oh, Jesus. This was really, really, really cool, I found, just because it, it can either take you something that's five minutes or, or even ten seconds, or it, it's going to be like half an hour or something like that. It all depends on your, your basically randomness. Like, you can't guess where it's going to be the goal. It's all based on random. Jeez, it's hard to die in Millie, man. It's really hard! Like, I find so much more differences in Millie and stuff, and you know what, like... Of course, Millie's such a better game, like I know that. I'm keeping the bat! Goodbye! <laughs> Every day? We're gonna actually go on the left side. I hate zombies! I hate zombies! Let's go this way. Go shaky. Do it. Fall. Come on. Oh, I wanted it to hit him! It would have been so cool! It would have been like the, the freaking movies or something. Though, like, I know that probably, like, I know that more people on Millie, community of Millie is a lot more competitive. So if you're watching this right now, like, why aren't you L canceling? Why aren't you doing this? Look, I play Brawl, not Millie. No hates. I'm just playing for these games for entertainment. I know people said that in Smash 64, like, why aren't you L canceling? Oh, there's the goal. Lovely. <laughs> and I was like, well, because I play Brawl, I'm just hitting people and hoping it works. <laughs> That's exactly what Brawl is compared to Millie. Like, there's nothing to do with physics or anything in Brawl. In Millie, it's all about so much calculations and, like, timing. And, like, it really takes a lot of focus. It's nothing like, wow, the camera's really freaking ugly in this stage. Jeez, is it always like, wow, you changed the chic? Okay, why can't I see right now? Can I change my camera? Like, can Oh, is my camera the C stick? <sighs> okay, because now I can adjust my camera. Come here, come here, come here. Uh, ow. I just wanted to cover you. <laughs> oh! Ow, ow. Yay! <laughs> I wanted to try that. I wanted to like actually just make her fall, but it didn't work very well. Come on. Oh, oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Just go! Freaking! Oh my God! Ah! Oh, tech! I teched! <laughs> oh Jesus! Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Oh, I put the ball! Really? 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 That's just, that's bogus, man. Freaking, get out of here. I can't believe I got a Goldeen out of all the Pokemons. Jeez. But there's so much added into this game. Like, 
like we have an adventure mode one. All star mode was also introduced in Millie. Uh, also, of course, a lot of new characters. Some that were supposed to be in the game but weren't. Uh, fun fact: even Sonic was supposed to be in Millie originally. Jeez, this C stick there. Okay, I have to stop pressing the C stick button. Damn. Uh, even Sonic was actually supposed to be part of this game, but. Uh, by the time they partnered with Sega after the Dreamcast failed, they didn't have enough time to add Sonic, which is why he was one of the first characters to uh, actually be working on in Brawl, but they only announced him later on before release, so that was funny. There were so many, like even a Pichu was actually- Wow! <laughs> Even Pichu was supposed to be. Oh wait, Pichu is a thing. No, I think it was someone else. I feel like another Pokemon was supposed to be. Even in Millie, I don't remember. But there's a lot of characters that are supposed to be playable in Warren. And even um, uh, I think it was Ness that was supposed to be replaced by Lucas in Millie. I think it was that. I don't remember. What it was like. Can you walk? Can you not? Wow, computers are smart. What the hell? Wow! Freaking computers, man! Bye! Oh! Suck it. <laughs> there we go. Stage clear. And just a reminder that next... Oh yeah, here's the race over here. Uh, this Saturday, there is Mario Kart 8 Tournament. So if you want to be part of that, it's at 1.30pm on Twitch. For more details, you can click the, the, the link in the description where all the rules and stuff. PK Sparks is also hosting it with me. So if you guys really want to hear his voice and see his hyperact activeness with me, excuse me, then how to hit that thing. Then totally go check out the description. Well, this is easy. I think there's actually trophies sometimes there on the side. Alright. No problem, man. We're just gonna keep I hope we get Mama Kirby! There's actually like if you finish at certain times during this game mode, you really get a lot of stuff that can change, like Mama Kirby here. Or, uh, or well, it's actually Giant Kirby, I call him Mama Kirby when I was a kid. And, like, even Luigi battling, stuff like that, you know, even Star Fo Fox appearing, and they said you can battle Falco. Oh, there was so much that was different. Oh, Kirby, I don't want to hurt you, man. Oh, my poor I'm sorry! Freaking seasick. <laughs> you need to take that off. I wish you could. Can you? No. not. Just get out. Too Oh yeah, there's tap jump too. Another thing in Millie, you cannot take off your tap jump, and that was something in Brawl that everyone did. You took off your tap jump. You were so excited. Unless you made like many characters that. Woo! Jeez, that took. Oh no. He did. What? What? What was that? He just wanted. <laughs> Kirby was like, oh boy, oh, I don't know what I did. And now we battle Team Kirby. Pretty sweet. Nice. Come on. It is so back back good. It is so good to be back in Montreal, by the way. I mean, I love being away, working on Project SC and stuff, which I'm gonna be talking about on Monday um, for the next playthrough starting up. But it was so nice, but at the same time, you know, I mean, I did miss recording. I mean, I haven't recorded in two weeks, and I'm recording right now Wednesday, so you guys are seeing this the next day, and it's just it feels so good to be back, like, recording, because it's been two weeks since I recorded it. Just, it felt weird. I don't know, like, every morning, you know, I'm planning when I'm to record and all that stuff. Why is there Dr. Mario? I hate doubles in this game, by the way. That is the one thing I hate in Millie, is all the doubles. So when Brawl, they announced Toon Link, I was like, go ahead. <laughs> wow, that was sparkly. Okay, Marth, I know you like your hair. So I'm just gonna burn it a bit. Okay. Just, yeah. Grab you. Come on, Falco. That ain't Falco! Who bought that t-shirt? That was on for a while. Where you can I think you can still buy it, but there is a t-shirt where you can buy saying that ain't Falco. Because of the, the wombo combo stuff. That was really popular. So if you guys have that, please tell me, because I know that it was awesome. I'm gonna throw an apple in I missed. Let's try this. Jesus. <laughs> Third time's a charm. Good job. Click that. There we go. There's just so much happening in Florida. I can't wait to tell you guys all about it. And now Corneria. <gasps> guys, this was my favorite stage when I was a kid. When I was a kid, this is what I would play on all the time. This is the one that I would always fight on. Not, like, not even gonna, gonna lie. Don't 
don't, don't even think about that. <laughs> this was the stage I would fight on. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you get burned for a while, but you're so stupid. <gasps> this was, this is what I would always play on. I mean, you start off Millie, you select your character. This is what I'd play. <laughs> Corneria was my favorite stage as a kid. The music, the I stage is just, oh, hey, gorgeous. Oh, now we're versus yeah, Falco, ready, of course. Everybody. I'm playing with all the characters unlocked, by the way. Thanks to Dragon Matt sending me his data file since mine corrupted when I was a kid. So thanks a lot, Dragon Matt. Dragon Matt's actually going to be featured, by the way, for next week's playthrough. We're doing a playthrough together. It's going to be the emissary for Brawl. You guys are going to notice a lot of uh, layouts, changes, layout changes. Uh, for next week, starting when the new playthrough starts up, it's going to be Brawl's Emissary. It's all going to be about World of Smash 4. Now, every video now until Smash 4's release is going to be about Super Smash Brothers. So, this is it, okay? So, now we're in the Smash Brothers finale. And now we got Melee left, we got Brawl. Next week, we got an FFA tournament style. Again, because you guys really, really liked the tournament style of last week. That's going to be out next Thursday. We also got a special guest next week. From, it's actually one of you teams. And then Brawl, uh, we're actually going to have another special guest. And then we're going to end off Brawl with a one-on-one -on -one competitive size. Since you, everybody knows that that's where I'm competitive with. And that's what my channel is known for, is for two Smash Brothers. Why are there so many Pokeballs? Oh, I should probably use Oh, shit. Did I live? Did I live? Oh, my God. I'm an expert at dodging. Avoid that. Avoid that, Pikachu. Oh, can we have a water type? Can we please have a water type? Can we? Can we? You're not water. You're in stupid. Let's you're, you're see you do something with water. Oh! Even better. <laughs> Sorry. I thought it was going to fall asleep there. Pikachu sleep. Oh, okay. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it again. Oh, now you get the water type. And they were just stupid. Now Pikachu literally looked at Blastoise going, Oh, I'm super effective against him. I'm totally gonna run. Let's do it. And now we're at F-Zero's Grand Prix. They should make another F-Zero. I am disappointed in Nintendo, like big time for not making one. Because like, this is the time, like we use a brand new start, new revolution type of thing. We are not gonna make it, are we? Oh! Oh! <laughs> I always when I was a kid I thought that I would be Sonic like because I always wanted him to be in the Smash Brothers series so I would legit always just uh, kind of I would always kind of pretend I'm Sonic right here be like rolling around at the speed of sound just constantly it was this game on the GameCube and Sonic Adventure 2 that I was I was obsessed when I was a kid. It was just those two games going back and forth. Of course, occasionally other games like Kirby Air Ride, Double Dash, Sunshine. Uh, those were pretty much the main games that I would play, to be honest. Not much other. Sonic Heroes, of course. Oh, I'm trying to understand the physics of Millie. I'm really it's so new to me. Yeah. Okay. Back, you know, if you feel kind of bad. Wow! Just gave you a freaking gift. Happy birthday, Falcon! You gonna get your game now? <laughs> See ya! Wow! They don't die. Like I, I find it impossible. I don't know if it's because it's normal mode, but it's normal mode. Don't! Saw that. It's the fucking punch. Oh, wow, 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 wow. I'm trying to do this perfectly. Don't even... <laughs> Please die. I'm going to freaking... Oh, that's invisible. I hate the invisible thing. I'm not even going to I found that the most useless item in Smash Brothers history, going invisible. Because you couldn't even see yourself. I don't know if it's just because I was a kid, but I find that I can't even see myself. Really bogus. All right, we got now the Nesses over here. I used to call them the rainbows because their colors were so saturated and they were always together. And they were like, the it's like, up goes the rainbow. Come on, man. Yeah. Adventure mode's really long. I, I completely forgot how long it is, but if you really don't know your shit, die. Wow! Freaking die. In Brawl, that'd be, you'd be dead. 
Wow! You bad bad! You shot like a thing! I hate I don't even Go, 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 gotta go fast. Okay, that that car went fast. And now for the finale. Oh, I want to I love slapping people. I love it when she bitch slaps people. It's my favorite thing to do. Come on. Hit it. Two. Come here. Come here. Two. Wow. I forgot that in Millie they're like really attracted to items. They're like, oh my god! It's a wild mess! Just get out of here. Bye. Sorry, Timmy. I <laughs> had to do it. <laughs> Come on. I think we might be near the end. We gotta climb this mountain, go through stuff, and then I think that's it. Those loading screens. They always think that like something's gonna freeze or something. It's, this one's not hard. You pretty much just have to keep on jumping. Oh, I'm gonna keep this with me so when they appear. Ow, Jesus! So when they appear, I'm just gonna throw it, honestly. Kick the butt! Go up here. Oh, another one. Maybe the other one was luckier. If this is a gold dean, I quit. I'm actually gonna quit. Ow. It should be going faster soon. I think it goes faster. If I remember correctly. Jeez, just go to hell. Two. Yeah, I think it's getting too fast. Not by much. Two. Oh, there we go. Two. Da, da, da. Two. Thank you. Pick up the two haze. Come on. This is a lot by Rumble two. Falls. Obviously, Rumble Falls was inspired two. by this one. Two. You guys think that. Two. Hold on. That was perfect. Two. Do you guys think that uh, Ice Climbers will return in Smash 4? I don't think they are. I'm going to be honest. I don't think they are. We got Rosalina and Luma. And, like, this game, wow. This game is trying to attract new audiences, which is why it's called Smash Brothers. Like, this is, like, kind of, like, not a reboot, but kind of, like, trying to attract new audiences type of thing. Since it's been, like, 15 years in history, so it's time for a new generation. And just no one knows Ice Climbers. It's just not, it's not in there. Battlefield is epic here, though. Like, I totally prefer this Battlefield over the... The brawl battlefield. This one is so. Oh yeah, you're you're floating here. I forgot that. But I also forgot how easy it is to kill these things. And then they, they. Wow, you just gave me a free kill, man. See you later. Okay, Captain Falcon. Keep your balls to yourself. Excuse my language. Bye. Oh, that works. Okay. Okay. Come here. Come here. I'm just gonna do that. Since it works. Give me my melon. Don't take my melon. Eat my feet. <laughs> Eat my feet. Yay. I also have heard that Sma uh, Meta Knight was announced in Smash 4 yesterday. But I'm only going to be talking about on Monday. Because this is all about Millie. I really wanted to focus on Millie. And then on... Oh, God. Oh, yeah. I forgot you fight not just... Metal Mario, when you fight Metal Mario and Luigi. Oh yeah, you can do it. Wow! Lame! It would have been better if it blew me up. Come on. Hit it. Do it. Hit it. Yes. Do it. Eat. Come on. I don't think we can get back up soon. What's that? Oh, it's coming. I think it's Oh! I think he's done. No, he's not. God, you're annoying. He's done. He's done. Oh God! Wow! Jeez, I'm just gonna poke him because that was really sad. He just opens his pokeball and it was like, <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't be tamed. And now we're gonna go fight on Master Hand, which returns from. Uh, oh, you don't fight. Yeah, it's true. Classic mode, you fight Master Hand. In, yeah, in. Adventure mode, you actually fight Bowser, which I like his size a lot better in this game. He has shrunk down so much in Brawl. He's a lot nicer here, to be honest. I like his design in uh, in Millie a lot better. Most of these designs, actually. Just in general, like, Brawl is a dark game. Like, the colors are off, I find. In general, it doesn't feel very alive. Like, I think it was, like, to attract older audiences for the Wii. But, yeah. I really like Bowser. 
And now in Smash 4, he just looks the best. Like, I think Smash 4 had him just perfectly. Woo! Aww. Come on. Nice! Awesome! So we have just completed Adventure Mode, which we're gonna be skipping the credits because it is just bogus. Oh, and another thing I introduced here is the trophies. So, in the first game, we had them as action figures. And because that's what Smash Bros. is based off of. And now here they introduce trophies where you can collect every single one. So this is like a really, really big game, you know. You not only have to complete Classic Mode, um, All-Star, Adventure, all that stuff. But you also have Mission Modes, Trophies to Collect, all that stuff. And then Brawl even expands more with re replays and mini games and more missions. The two-player missions and then the Story Mode. They just went over the there you go, guys. So that was Millie. We're going to watch this. Congratulations. There it is. I love Sheik. She is just awesome, and I'm so happy she's going to be playable in Hyrule Warriors. It's just, oh, and I like how you get both of so that really made me happy. But that is it, guys. That is Super Smash Bros. Millie for Nintendo GameCube. Came out in 2001. Uh, one of the, if not the best and most popular game on the GameCube, and the best in the series. So if you've never tried Millie, you better be sure you do. For this question of this video and of the week since we haven't had one i want to know which character did you use in millie and why of course pretty obvious i'm just curious i want to know that and just a reminder that this saturday is going to be mario kart 8's tournament so it's on twitch and if you want details as i said before click the link in the description below but until then guys thank you guys so much for watching please like comment and subscribe for more videos visit my website www.supergirlkelsgk.webs.com for tournament streams music, music and more that you can find here and i will see you guys on saturday for the finale of kirby triple deluxe and as well as the mario kart tournament see you guys then bye bye